Every single time I've had a dog here and they've weed, I've stood in it barefoot every single time. I haven't learnt my lesson yet, but... Hello, welcome back to another vlog. I haven't spoke to you since I filmed the first clip a few days ago, which was wrapping my uh, presents for my partner's birthday. So that was a couple of days ago now and his birthday went really well. Presents were hit, so glad about that. I'm currently getting ready because it is a Friday night. It's actually St. Patrick's night, the night I'm filming right now. And I'm heading out for dinner with my partner and our friends, and then I'm going to a concert with my friend going to see Sly Withers at the record buy but I thought I'd just come on intro the vlog and get ready for the night the following day last night was so much fun I drank quite a lot so today I've had a very lazy day I woke up so late and then I just watched Cruella with my partner and then finally had a shower washed my hair and now I'm heading to my friends I'm gonna go through her closet and see if there's anything that I can borrow for my trip to Europe and visit Lulu the puppy so I thought I'll bring you along to that because you always seem to like the footage that I get of Lulu but last night was so much fun it was St. Patrick's Day I don't know if I mentioned that so I uh, had quite a few beers before I even went for dinner and then the night out so it was a little rough when I came home not gonna lie but that's okay Hi. I'm going to be puppy sitting Coco tonight. So that's my family dog. She just turned 10 last week. So I'm very excited. So I'm heading off to catch up with my mom today. And then we are gonna go grab Coco and bring her back here. So I can't wait to show you what I get up to with Coco. But first let's go out for the day. Okay, I have Coco. She's at my house. She's been here for 
the whole afternoon now so I thought it's time to introduce you I've taken her for a walk and we've just been hanging out she had a nap as well for us but yeah she's very cute so she's a 10 year old Suki Cross West Highland Terrier so let me show you you want to say hi? you want to say hi? Coco is off to meet my friend's puppy, the Pomeranian Lily. So hopefully the meeting will go well. They've never met. Um, Coco's pretty good with dogs. She is 10 though. So sometimes puppies, if they're in her face too much, she doesn't love that. But uh, Lily's quite timid. So I think they'll get on. I have, my partner and I went to a vegan uh, like little marketplace today. We took Coco there. She was a big hit. Everyone loved her. But yeah, I'm hoping I haven't pooped her out too much because like I said, she is 10. But she's had a little bit of a sleep. She's over here on the couch. She looks pretty excited to go out. She can already sense that we're about to head back out. So I'll try and get a little bit of footage on my phone and fingers crossed the two dogs get on. It is much later. Coco is sadly back home, but I had such a lovely time puppy sitting her. It's always so much fun. Um, she did pretty good meeting Lulu. She did snarl at her once, which is obviously not good, but aside from that like she got over it quite quickly i wouldn't say they're like best friends but they definitely were interested in each other and like were pretty good with each other so happy with how that went um i was very impressed because all day i was like she didn't mark inside at all so like previously when a puppy sat she has peed on my rug before because i've had two dogs visit here before and they've both peed so they can like smell where she's gone so i was like awesome she hasn't done it this time that's amazing dropped her off to my sister's home was like yep she hasn't done it my brother was like you'll probably find like some sneaky pee somewhere and I was like no I've checked she's actually done really really well came home um, was watching YouTube stood up to help my partner with dinner kicked a wine glass sliced my foot open and it just started bleeding so i've got a slice on my foot where i've band-aided it and then fast forward about half an hour later i've got my band-aid foot limping around limped on my rug back to my bean bag and yes indeed she actually did wee right on the edge of it luckily it's not on the carpet but still not good i have some stuff to like bring the smell out but I was like, damn it, and every single time I've had a dog here and they've weed, I've stood in it barefoot every single time. I haven't learnt my lesson yet, but that's okay, I'll forgive her. She's 10 years old, so I guess I'll let it go. But I did have such a lovely day. It's been a nice weekend, not too busy, but a nice mix of like chill things and catching up with people. So I just thought that I'd pop back on, fill you in with how the rest of the day went and sign off the vlog. So I hope you've enjoyed this vlog. I'd love to know if you're enjoying this more like um, relaxed style of vlogging. I definitely prefer it. As always, please don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. Do follow me over on my Instagram. It's just at Brooke McQuaid. I put up a few photos of Coco from the weekend and I'll see you in my next vlog.